Hey guys, welcome back to Overbite Gaming, and today I did it, lads. I did it. We have Stubbs the Zombie in Rebel Without a Pulse. I finally managed to pick up a copy for twenty pounds on eBay. Um, so I am very happy with that, considering I was looking at paying fifty to sixty pounds before, and one popped up for twenty, and I was straight on that bastard. I was like a rat up a drain pipe. Okay, I, I don't know how that compares, but whatever. So, today we are doing a quick Let's Play of Stubbs the Zombie and Rebel Without a Pulse. Um, I have lowered the music volume a bit because it's busy playing a lot of licensed music right now. Uh, if you see ads, that's the reason. We don't, we don't monetize our videos, so if you see ads, I've been schnookered by one or more music companies. <laughs> they can fight for the point one of a fento pence anyway guys i've been teasing it long enough i think well let's get on with it you can see it's in four by three because it's an old game it took me approximately about 40 minutes to actually get it working <coughs> right okie doke well you know me easy yes yeah, so i had to uh install uh specific graphic stuff and actually make it think it was running call of duty for some reason which is weird but it's based on the uh, Halo, the original Halo engine, so yeah. But we'll go through, do the tutorial, first level or so, probably about 20 minutes worth of Let's Play. So let's go, I always play on easy because I like the story. Ha 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 ha. It's big, Monday tone. Where one city has entered the 21st century 50 years ahead of schedule. Welcome to Punchbowl, a city built for the space age. Here in Punchbowl, experimental science and state-of-the-art technology create a futuristic paradise, the likes of which have never been seen. This is a city unlike any other, free of crime, pollution, poverty, and other urban blights. Menial labor is a thing of the past, thanks to all the robots who keep Punchbowl running like clockwork. People can't stop talking about it, and why should they? Punchbowl is a model of good old American ingenuity. Much of it developed by famed scientist Dr. Herman Y, now a naturalized American citizen working for the good guys. But who's funding this fantastic foray into futurism? Why, none other than billionaire playboy industrialist Andrew Monday. America's favorite have his brain. to riches story is the visionary who's calling the shots in this town at the grand opening ceremony this morning, the world's richest man had this to say. Here in Punchbowl, for the first time in human history, life is what it was meant to be, free of all unpleasantness. Why, someday the entire world will be like Punchbowl, but for now, it stands alone, a beacon of purity and human potential in a world of social upheaval and moral turpitude. Bold words from a bold man. But perhaps it's not the bold. Only I've thing seen bold men. I am one. Orphans rise to fame and fortune is the city he's built, where everyone is invited to drink their fill of the future. And no one has a care in the world. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Get your hands off my weenie! Good morning! Is everything okay? God, helpful he tutorial, robot. Dog. Well, that wasn't very nice. Stealing is loud in punch bowl. You'll have to give it back. Oh. If you'd like something to eat, I can show you one of Punchbowl's many fine dining establishments. Yeah, go eat something else, jerk. Go on, get out of here. Sounds reasonable. He stole my hot dog. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh my, looks like he's having some kind of brain seizure. We'd better find some way of relieving the pressure in his head. <laughs> Why, me? Nom. My, I think wow, gonna... you sure calm him down. He's not even twitching anymore. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, silly me. I haven't even introduced myself. I'm a guide bot here to provide any information you might need during your stay in our fair city. Would you like the full tour? Oh, come on. I can tell by the look on your face. You're gonna love Punch Bowl. Follow me. We've got so much to see. I've got a whole data tape filled with 640... Use keyboard to move. That, that. <laughs> It'll take us a few hours 
That narrows it down to what, 107? Bit, okay. You get around pretty well for someone with a gaping hole in his stomach. If you like, we can visit Punchbowl General Hospital and have that looked at. Oh, but there's so much to see first. Come along. She's so bossy. Oh. My zombie chum. Yes, when you eat someone's brains, they also become a zombie. Hello, zombie chum. He's not as interesting as me, apparently. I'm coming. I'm coming. There seems to be some kind of commotion down the street. Never a dull moment in Punch Bowl. Let's go have a look. Mm, a policeman. Be quiet, guide bot. All right, buddy. You're coming with us. But officer, we just started the tour. The tour's over. We don't want a sick bum in an ugly tie walking around on opening day stinking up the place. Nor do we actually want to touch that guy. Ugh. Exactly. So we're just going to stand here nice and quiet. And you are going to get in the back of the squad car. And we'll all be happy. Well, I won't be happy. We're waiting. Tap, tap, tap. I guess you don't have any choice. I'm trusting you to do the right thing here, buddy. My partner! Please, not the throat! Hey! So this is definitely like in the oeuvre of Return of the Living Dead rather than Night of the Living Dead. I think that's where the whole brain thing came from. Freeze! Double. You're surrounded! This can't be happening. What is it? Oh, I see. You got gas. <laughs> I'll just head over here for a minute while you uh, relieve the pressure. All right, buddy, you're going downtown. Hey, hands where I can see them. Have you thought about changing your diet? You really should. <laughs> And the horde grows. Oh, look, there's Steve. Oh, we'll never get anywhere unless you push those fellas out of the way. Walk up behind one of them. Now give them a gentle shove in the right... <laughs> Wonderful! Now we can continue the tour. Come on, boys, let's go. Well, why don't you call your new friends over? First, stand perfectly still and transfix them with your steely gaze. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now purse those lips and whistle. <laughs> well done. They're heading right over. I have the zombies. I need the victims now. Now, we still have a lot to see, and I don't want you collapsing of exhaustion before the tour ends. So if you feel tired or winded or in agonizing pain because someone just ran up and slugged you for no reason... That was uncalled for. Then feel free to take a few seconds to relax and recuperate. You'll feel much better after a few deep breaths. All right? Excellent! I'll be over by the gate when you're ready to tour the green. Yeah, regenerating health. Definitely based on the Halo engine. Um, blur. I'm looking for people, people to join my club. Oh, there's one. He doesn't actually make any noise when he runs. That's a bit strange. Hello. Hey, we got a female zombie. This one's my girlfriend. Oh, yep, yeah, the lads are on the move. Look at them all. Right, enough of that. Let's actually move on. Although, in truth, I could just go around chomping people's wings all day. Like 
against the butter. Who said that? Nah, who cares? Let's go. Yeah, he does get additional abilities. I think we'll probably see at least one more. He gets like an explosive spleen that he pulls out and throws at people. And... You can also possess humans by severing your arm, having it run about the place, and then grabbing people by the head. Be safe, have fun, eat brains. These are good life lessons, I feel. Ow, 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 ow. They do seem to be unconcerned about having their yeah, brains eaten. Eating my soul. I think we may have a zombie on our hands here. That one's obviously a learned gentleman. Oh, sounds like we got copper. Oh god. Yeah, there we are. Let's get the policeman. My lads can deal with him. Well done, my minions. Ah, oh, more coppers. Because you were the closest friend. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> I'm not sure how the one without a head is going to uh, function as a brain-eating zombie, but I suppose he can flail at people, so that's okay. Oh, hello. Monorail. I really want this to have a remaster, because it's really good fun. And obviously... It does have something sort of to be desired in the graphical front. I haven't actually investigated whether I can mod it or if there's any sort of fan patches, stuff like that. Because, to be honest, I was quite busy enough trying to get the damn thing to run in the first place. But it really is sort of ripe for remastering. Okay, that's all the coppers down. Let's go in the monorail station. Need to make a quick getaway? The punch ball monorail is the best way to get around the city. Oh. Helpful public announcements. Guys, he makes my sex noises. It's quite off putting. I send some necrophilia coming up. Is everything satisfactory, Miss Monday? Yes, Sonny. 
Uh, sure you don't need anything? Uh, a cold drink? Uh, no. A cigarette? No. Foot massage? Oh, I'm... what? No, nothing. Uh, never mind. You're a nice man, Mr. Skegness, but don't you have better things to do than make passes at your employer's mother? I'm just doing my job, Miss Monday. Andrew asked me to look after you, and I'm going to make sure uh, nothing unseemly happens on this uh, wonderful... Uh, Sunny. Fabulous. Sunny. Huge. Eyes up here. Day. Better come with me, Miss Monday. This doesn't look like a safe place for you. Perhaps we can go back to my place. Nice try, Mr. Skegness! Poor Stubbs. Simply <laughs> help, you can drive any vehicle with a steering wheel icon over, press E to enter a vehicle when you're standing near a seat. Press left click to continue. I'm aware of it, but it's nowhere near as fun as eating people's brains. Sorry, Bush. Ah. For a burst of good old sod. I stole a sod tank. Okay, seems to work, so I'm okay with that. Never take me alive, copper. Oh! Okay, now I'm disorientated. <laughs> I think this way. So I would normally just eat their brains, but I know there's other sod tanks around here, so... I'm trying to not like to run in my own shots as well, because... That will do to me what it does to them. There's one. Bye. Uh, go on. There we are. Three for one, baby. Three for one. Oh. <laughs> Deep saving. I have no idea whether I'm going the right way, but there are. Oops. There are additional bad guys, so I'm assuming. I've not been here before. The characters in the game don't really seem to be overly concerned about dying or having their brain. Uh, that could have been my zombies. That that was my zombies. Fortunately, they're a bit hardier than the old humies. Guess that's what being dead already gets you. Right, where do I go then? Ah, oh. Blimey! Do I go here? Let's have a look. Oh, we have footsteps now. Well, I don't think so. Okay, moving on. For as, like, graphically behind the times as it is, I do like the aesthetic of it. The sort of... The 50s cross with, like, sci-fi type deal. Got a Flash Gordon, you know? Aha! Yeah, look, we have foot footfalls. Wonderful. Alright, copper! Not the face! Can't 
Nom. I'll eat them next, it's fine. You'll all be together. Right there. We're approaching horde level. Killing me. I'll never forget you. What's your name? Sit down. Go, 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 go. Awesome. Okay. Um. Yeah, the sound doesn't seem to be behaving quite as I would expect it. We had like a. Uh, a generator noise going on for most of that, and it just cut out. Wee. Oh, there's something up there. Stupid. Oh, ow! Try and have a scratch and just bump the mic, because I'm an idiot. Here we go. Operate control! Mm, looks like there's a whole bunch of policemen coming. Excellent. Send more cops. Probably should get a pop shooter from me to do that again. Never mind. Right, so I think it's going to be back this way. Hello. Oh, someone's shooting. Oh, yep, yeah, there he is. Back on him, his Soto mobile. Oh, I have a passenger. I don't think these zombies were really smart enough to understand, like, passenger seats, but... Aha! Boom! Ain't getting back on that, you little bastard. Okay, do I need to get off? I guess I need to get off. Go on, mate, let's go get them. Hello! Oh, those scientists are quite combative. Um, this looks very much like a dead end. Gosh darn it. See, he knew. He's patiently waiting for me. Alright, that's good. There are similarities in piloting this to the Warthog in Halo. Which wouldn't be unexpected since it's based on the same engine. Oh! Oh! You son of a bitch! It's okay though, it didn't. I can still get in. You coming? Yeah, he's coming. Even like what I would describe as like boring. Okay, I'm not gonna get out of here, I guess. No, out. Thank you. Yeah, what I would describe as like boring, uh, sort of tanky sections aren't even that boring because instead, oh, for God's sakes, it could do with a, ch a checkpoint marker. That, I was just saying there. Just, just, just a little bit of a. A bit of a criticism. Right. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, yeah, so I can't drive in real life. This explains much to you, I suspect. Yeah, because, like, where you're not just, like, thunking against the tank's armor, it's actually having effects, you know, like that. Oh, yes, here we go. Right then. I'm assuming this is where we need to be. I've made that assumption twice before and been wrong, so we'll see. It was quite heavily guarded, so yes! Ha <laughs> ha! Hmm. 
Why do I want fried chicken all of a sudden? Weird. Wow. Although this, some parts of the sound keeps dropping out, the uh... It is localizing to my ears, so it might localize to your speakers or headphones. Oh, you gave him a kick. Well, to be fair, you could have run away, in fairness. I, w I was quite preoccupied eating that copper's brain. Oh. It's me, Guidebot. Hello, Remember Guidebot. Me from the plaza? Are you sure that hole in your side doesn't bother you? Because it bothers me. I can see all those internal organs slurping around in there. Oh, here we go. I'm going to see his other special but well, one of his other. G to throw your guts. It was his gut, not his pancreas. Alright. I, I, I'm actually attempting to do it. And it's, oh, there we go. It's decided to do it. Well, that was intermittent. I do, I do think it insta-changes them, though. If I'm honest. Yep, they're getting up. Excellent. So you have a grenade that basically creates you a zombie horde, which is pretty sweet. But I won't be using it too much. This. Oh. Oh, don't eat me. No, 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 no. You punched a zombie. What the fuck did you think was gonna happen? That's alright, I'm going in through the back of your head, so. Wish granted. Come on, where are you at? You just watching this guy or what? There we go. It's my teeth. Hello. Okay, that seemed rather self-defeating, but uh, let's go. Obviously, slightly hard to make a zombie out of a machine. Oh look, there's another one. <laughs> Breathe through the back of your head? What? 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 Oh, yeah, look. They're unaware of me. No! 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 You, this! Oh my god. No Don't eat me! No, 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 no! It's okay, you die from the arm that just came off you anyway, so. I'll show you what. Come, come here, you little bastard. There we go. Full Nelson head bite. Nice. No, I shall not. It agrees with my sense of justice.
You're gonna arrest the zombie. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure that's gonna go well for you. Oh, they have ray guns now. What do you think? Eating this many pe uh, policemen brains. Does it get me SJW points? Maybe? Too soon? Maybe. It's not going to stop me though. I am going to eat more brains. There's one. I'm bringing you in. No, you're not. I've got a wife and kids. Yeah, those guys have like stun gauntlets with electricity. Oh. Okay, I've been playing for probably about 15 minutes now. And I've just realized I can swipe with the light left mouse button instead of the R key. So I would suggest a better tutorial is in order. <laughs> Come on. Oh no. I want to kill him. I just wanted to, um, you know, indoctrinate him. There we go. Killing me. He just ate my brain. Please, not the throat. I'm not sure if you like ate someone's brain, there would be that much blood. Sit down. Can't it, literally, it just sprays the entire environment when you bite someone. I, mean, I just... Oh, never mind. Wait, look at it go! Sounded like it just powered down. <laughs> I'll show you what. Stop hitting me. Even I wouldn't do it. Oh. Come on. No need me. No, 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 no. Ow. Please. Not the throat. I see one of them. I'll show you what for. Hey, stop choking me. You getting enough lead in your diet? I'm bringing you in. Hey! Stop! Choking me! I see one of them! I'll show you! Oh, I my brain! All day. The dead walk. Oh, mighty voices in my head. I'll never doubt you again. The commies have infiltrated this country so completely that even the dead have turned against us. Well, the Quaker state irregulars ain't going without a fight. <laughs> Why would you have a sign bigger than the building? That doesn't make any sense to me. Good morning, officers. Good morning, Pumper. Kill her up? Yeah, but make it snappy. We're in the middle of a zombie holocaust. Okie dokie, one tank of extra leaded coming right up. I'm not sure I have enough cash to cover. Oh, never you mind, sir. It's on the house. Oh, there's no need for that. Oh, oh it's my pleasure, officers. Oh, God. My pleasure. Hey, what 
me to look under the hood? No, I need to use the restroom. Oh, it's uh, around the back. Yeah, go ahead. I'll try to keep him from eloping with the car. <laughs> Well, you know, it's a good thing you stopped by, officer. There's been a bit of lawlessness this afternoon. Tell me about it. Strangest thing, this gentleman, a very ill one by the look of it. Wait a minute. Green skin, festering wound in his guts, ugly tie. I'm never gonna get used to seeing that. Huh. Ain't that a kick in the head? No! <laughs> And I think, ladies and gentlemen, we will leave it there. So that is Stubbs the Zombie, Rebel Without a Pulse. I've been quite quiet through this playthrough, mainly because I've been enjoying myself. But also, it's quite a funny game, I think. I know humor is subjective, but to me, it, the, it does land. I mean, like the robot fucking the car. Who else would do that? Come on. I'm pretty sure it's been done before, actually, thinking about it. But perhaps not that early. Perhaps not that early, because I, I really should have kept the box handy, because I could have told you the date this was released, but I imagine it was already 90s. Wow. I mean, like, before monitors were the proper shape and everything. <laughs> anyway, guys, that was Stubbs. Probably not the most interesting playthrough, because I was just enjoying the hell out of that. But, yeah, if you can find it for, like, 20 quid, I would definitely say pick it up. But the prices it's going for... Particularly the Mac version. The Mac version is ridiculously expensive. Uh, on eBay. Uh, don't pay over the odds for it. If you see it for a good price, snap it up as quickly as you can. Um, otherwise, you could check like bookstores, stuff like that. You know, the, the thrifty ones. Uh, see if it turns up there. It, it was out on the 360 as well. I'm not sure about PS3. I think it was just 360. So you could get that version. That would, that would work too. Yeah. But I don't have a 360. I'm not sure it's on the Xbox One's backwards comp compatibility list either. So, uh, but like, yeah, if they're doing like, oh shit, I can't remember the name of it, uh, the Alien game that's like Mars Attacks. But oh man, I've actually got it. But they're remastering that soon, right? So, what better compliment could you have to a zombie invasion game? The, a zombie. An alien invasion game, it would be a zombie outbreak game. With copious amounts of humour, lots of blood and gore, brain eating, hordes of zombies, at your beck and call, running around, exploding body parts, lethal farts, controlling hands. Sounds like a good time, really. Yeah. Anyway guys, let me know if you've played Stubbs the Zombie Rebel Without a Pulse before down below. And if you haven't, tell me what you thought. Because, like, yeah, it looks dated. It is is dated. It controls okay. Obviously, he's a zombie, so he doesn't go as fast as you really want all the time. But he is dead, so we got to give him, got to give him a little bit of a slack there. Uh, we release videos Wednesdays and, and Saturdays. i got to say that, otherwise Snare pins me to the bed and does unspeakable things to me. He's, he's, he's my little sugar bear. But outside of that, like, comment, down, subscribe, all that down there. If you do happen to subscribe, consider consider the bell because YouTube being YouTube might not decide to like pop us up in your feed, which happens. So ring the bell and you'll get something pop up and interrupting, you know, your Pornhub browsing. I apologize in advance. Mm. Anyway, you guys, I'll catch you next time.